The cow nose ray is a large cartilaginous fish that migrates in schools throughout its range. These rays are found in the western Atlantic Ocean from southern New England to Brazil, including the Gulf of Mexico. They inhabit estuaries and coastal waters. Each fall, schools numbering in the thousands seek warmer habitats. They mainly occur from the surface to 200 feet deep. Their disc is wider than it is long. Their whip-like tail is usually longer than their disc. A cow nose ray has one venomous barbed spine at the base of its tail. The rays use these spines in self-defense, and their venom is not fatal to humans. They rarely rest on the bottom, so they are unlikely to be stepped on. They use electroreception to search sandy seafloors for burrowed prey. Once the prey is located, the ray uses its pectoral fins to stir up sediment, while at the same time sucking water and sediment out through its gills and away from the seafloor to filter out the prey. This creates a steep depression in the sediment. Cownose rays crush their prey using their strong, flattened teeth. They primarily consume bivalves, along with crustaceans and worms. They spit out the crushed shells and eat the soft body parts. Cownose rays have a slow reproductive rate. They mature between 4 and 8 years old. They bear live young. Often only a single pup is born each year. Fish like cobia, sandbar sharks, and bull sharks prey on cownose rays. The rays are common bycatch in fisheries. The meat can be consumed fresh or salted. Because of the cownose rays diet, it has long been regarded as a pest by the commercial shellfish industry. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.